Connecting a SunPal solar controller will depend on your specific model and type of solar controller. However, I can provide you with a general guide on how to connect our SunPal solar charge controller. Always refer to the user manual that comes with our solar controller for the most accurate and detailed instructions. Here are the general steps. Step 1. Gather the necessary equipment. You'll need a SunPal solar controller, SunPal solar panels, SunPal batteries, SunPal inverter, and the appropriate cables and connectors. Step 2. Determine the controller's location. Choose a suitable location for the SunPal solar controller, preferably near the batteries and the solar panels. Make sure it is easily accessible for monitoring and maintenance. Step 3. Mount the controller. Install the controller securely on a wall or surface using the provided mounting brackets or screws. Step 4. Connect the solar panels. Connect the solar panels positive, plus, and negative terminals to the corresponding terminals on the solar controller. Ensure proper polarity to avoid damage. Make sure to use a solar panel circuit breaker in the off position. Step 5. Connect the batteries. If you have batteries, connect the positive, plus, and negative E terminals of the batteries to the appropriate terminals on the solar controller. Again, pay attention to the correct polarity. Make sure to use a battery switch in the off position. Step 6. Connect the inverter to the load. If you have a load, such as lights or appliances, that you want to power with the solar system, connect it to the load terminals on the solar controller. Step 7. Check the connections. Double check all the connections to ensure they are secure and properly tightened. Loose connections can cause performance issues or even damage the equipment. Step 8. Power on the system. Once everything is connected, turn on the battery switch followed by the solar panel circuit breaker and monitor its display or indicators to ensure it is functioning correctly. You will see the solar panel icon and battery icon on the display. Lastly, turn on the SunPal inverter. You should now have a working solar system. Please note that the specific steps may vary depending on the model of the solar controller. It's always recommended to refer to instruction manuals for detailed guidance. If you're unsure or uncomfortable with the installation process, it's best to consult our solar installers to ensure a safe and reliable connection. SunPal, making more power.